Hi, my name is Lindsay Webster, and this is my oil belt story. All right, I can't awesome. do this. This is great. <laughs> the first time I came to camp, I was one of those homesick babies, and I remember actually crying <laughs> at the campfire out there. And they called my mom, and my mom was like, "Let's just see how she is, you know, like tomorrow or whatever." And um, I wasn't eating. And so they called my mom and they said, she's not eating. And my mom said, oh my goodness, she's really sick if she's not eating. So she came and picked me up. <laughs> okay, so I started coming to camp, I feel like whenever I first could. Went to Athletes Week, Music Camp, Senior High, Deeper Life, pretty much every camp for my age group um, once I got over the homesickness. Well, my favorite one is when Harvey Wadlow came and was the missionary and did the African banquet because I loved I love eating, <laughs> and that was my favorite thing when they decorated the cafeteria with the leaves and everything, and um, the hut, and I remember like the sand and all the fake bugs and stuff all, all throughout. I loved that, and I, my favorite thing was the banana fritters. I loved that. Well, my friends always wanted to get with boys, <laughs> and I was not like that. I was very shy, and so I did not really do that. Well, we loved bringing snacks in the dorms, which was a no-no. And we loved writing notes to each other during nap time, which we got in trouble for a lot because we were supposed to be sleeping. But we just wanted to talk and hang out. But I remember camp being a place where we felt the presence of God and His Spirit. And we always, um, people say like, you experience a God high. And I feel like we really did every time we were here. and that's one thing I love about Oil Belt Weather. Like the faculty that I remember the most were the people who like talked to us and wanted to be with us and not just with each other. Oh, Kathy White. I loved when she was the dorm mom. <laughs> James Mulvaney, Matt Johnson, and Keith Graham. Loved his weeks. When I, whenever I was a faculty member, my favorite was always the faculty hunt. I loved doing that at night. Uh, but when I was a camper, my favorite game was the kitty cat game from Keith Graham. I always loved looking for all the cats, and I'm pretty competitive, so I wanted to win. <laughs> so I never imagined that I would be working here, which is pretty crazy how God works. Um, so I work in the office, and I'm in charge of registrations for all of our events and um, do all the fun office stuff, financial stuff. Working at camp is very different than being a camper or even a faculty member. Um, I, I never realized how difficult it was to work here as far as how much work it takes to do camp. You don't see that side of it unless you're actually working here. So I appreciate all the people who worked here whenever I was a camper because it takes just so much um, to make camp awesome. Okay, I love family camp um, because I can attend it mostly. I miss being a camper and it's really awesome to be part of Oil Belt and still be able to camp here. So some of my favorite things about family camp is that I grew up coming here with my parents and my siblings. And now what well, I come with my husband and my baby. And so that's really cool. I loved Whenever I was old enough to stay by myself, my friends and I were cool and we would stay in a tent. And so I love doing that every, um, every fall time. We always have good stories about that. So some of the things I'm looking forward to or hoping that camp will be is just to continue to grow, um, continue to put God first and the teaching of His Word and baptizing kids, um, loving kids, having fun, I just hope to see that not dwindle away and the kids still come again. Yeah, so some of the things I remember, um, I remember walking to the pool when we didn't have a pool here. And I remember one time we, we did a night swim and James Fruits, I don't know if he was the dean or if he was just faculty. I think he was probably the dean. But he, we were sitting outside the pool, outside, you know, the pool, and he just started leading worship. And so we did like a really cool worship service outside the pool one night, and I thought that was really cool. At family camp one time, 
uh, it was me and Abby Shelton now and Elise Cox or Cross and we were staying in a tent and we went to the bathroom late at night and my friend Abby we were trying to get ready for bed and everything and she <laughs> was being silly and she was leaning I don't know what we were doing anyway she broke the sink off of the wall <laughs> in the middle of the night. So we ran back to our tent and all that, but I remember that.